You need this guy. You want, you want Fredbear plush. Goodbye, my friend. Oh my gosh, I did not. Oh, there's so many of them. Please, don't hurt me. Oh, you can slide your butt while sitting. Oh, you're even more adorable. Hello everybody and welcome back to a brand new episode today on Roblox. My name is Digi and today I'm showing you all a couple of new stuff on a game you all know called the Pizzeria Roleplay Remastered. So let's go ahead. Kevin get over here. Do not hide from your fans. <sighs> let's go bad chunting. Alright everyone, so we are in the game and ready to go. Now before we go ahead and click off the change log, I'm gonna go ahead and read through it for you all. The change log and the update is called Off the Shelves. And it says, whether for sale or forgotten, the toys found in stores can provide endless joy. But what happens when a child's source of fun turns around into horror? Enjoy new characters inspired by what may be found on the shelves. Explore new locations, including updates to FNAF 4 and a newly opened store whose owner seems to be needing some help. Only you can find out what happens when you take a cursed toy off the shelves. Whoa! And then here we go. This is the new store, Jim's Merch Shack. And oh gosh, that is cursed. Burn it with fire. Holy fire. And then I guess is a snapshot of what is to come. And then there's a lot of changes right here. You guys can go ahead and pause it and read all that. But let's go ahead and get right into this so ladies and gentlemen we are going to be getting achievements today all right there are going to be four achievements for everybody every single one of you but some of them give you things and some of them do not all right so the first one we're going to start off with is called not a fan solve jim's fan problem all right well let's go ahead and get to it so jim we're going to help you what we want to do is go over here to Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. We're going to go to FNAF 1, the one that says 1993. So go ahead and click on that. All right, it does not matter what you become. You can be an animatronic or a human, but I'm going to go ahead and be myself. So now once you're in the FNAF 1 location, what we want to do is actually go out the back. So the way, the quickest way is to go right here into the kitchen and out the back side here the loading dock then take your right <clears throat> you're then gonna see a little shop over here called jim's merchandise or merch shack oh gosh ah, i've been hit by car i'm okay though <laughs> oh let's pick that up hey all right so what we want to do is walk inside and here is jim hey hey potential customer i mean hey there uh, what's this about? Help wanted? Uh, believe it or not, Jimmy here's got a fan problem. I've got a desk fan in the back room, not just won't stop spinning. Uh, alright, I'm interested. <laughs> Suddenly I'm interested. It's driving away the customers. Way too loud. Continue? So what I'm proposing is for someone to go through the back room and get it for me. You up for it? What's the pay? Hmm? Introducing my <clears throat> Fatty Foes Bars brand new plushie release, Fancer the Fan. Makes a great gift. Sure, I'll do it. <laughs> I'll do it for a plushie. All right, just a fair warning. It gets a bit hot back there sometimes. So to compensate, let's just say I've had to continue. <gasps> Crank up the AC. All right, come back when you've got the fan sooner the better. I don't know why they're like shaggy. But anyways, go ahead and walk into the storage door like that. And it will teleport you to this area. Now, this is a lobby. Or an obby. Sorry. And you have to do certain things to get through this. Now, go ahead. Jump on those boxes. Jump on these right here. And then you're going to see these lamps. Go ahead. Jump on them. 
and it, it helps if you wait till they get closer to each other. Now be aware that you do not move with the lamp, so make sure you move along with it yourself. Here we go. Ah, yes. Oh, let's do a quick one. There we go. All right, go ahead and go across the balance beam there. Jump on down. Go to these boxes. Jump up. You will see these fans. They will not kill you. They just send you upwards like that. Hold on. There we go. They can be a little tricky. Now, if you fall, it's very easy. You can just go right here to this box, and the fan will shoot you up. Now, we need to get to that little lever over there. To do so, we got to go on these fans. Now, this can be a little tricky, and you will maybe mess up a couple times. So, don't worry. Don't get discouraged. It's fine. You got all the time in the world. It is not timed at all. There we go. And then let's wait till I get shot up. And then one more time. There we go. Pull the lever. And you're going to then see that this turned on. Now, what you need to do next is go here. Now, you can just do it from down here. Just jump up. It might take a little bit there we go and it should launch you up to here so from down there to right here jump on this lamp get across boom and if you fall don't worry you can then climb back out and jump onto the fan now go ahead jump on straight down now over here there is a fan on what you want to do is quickly jump right there so that you don't get blown away now this part can be a little tricky ladies and gentlemen so first what you want to do is go onto this fan right here and then hold on there ah send me up there we go all right then after that go over to here then it should launch you over across and then get onto these boxes now before we keep going next achievement all right all right so the what we're going for right now is called Jim's secret supply find secret way through Jim's warehouse. I already have it because I, I didn't know if I was going the right way the first time or not. But here we go. Let's go ahead and get this achievement. What you want to do is go across this little uh, rope. Jump on these boxes and you're going to see a vent or a fan down there. Now what you want to do is try to aim for the sides so then you can go straight through. If not, it will shoot you back up and then you just have to do this again and try again. So I'm gonna try to see if I ah oh, I didn't I didn't fall far enough. All right, so as you can tell, that's how you do it. It can be a little tricky. It can take a couple tries, but then you have this little mini obby. Now go ahead and just move along with the fans. They will not move you, but don't worry. If you do fall, there is a fan right there on the ground floor, and then just keep moving along. Here we go. Then go right here. Fly right on up like this way. And then you're going to go through this doorway. It's going to do a little teleportation. And right there, the propeller hat. All you got to do is bump into it. And ladies and gentlemen, Jim's secret supply. Now to get back to here, what you want to do is simply just go back through that obby. And then it will shoot you back up here. And then we can continue on from where we were before, which was right here. And now we're going to go back to doing the not a fan achievement. All right, so start from where we left off. Go to the boxes here. Go onto this fan. It will then shoot you across. Jump over this way. Then pull the lever. And then what we're going to do then is go all the way back down this way on top of these boxes. And there we go. As you can see, the fan has now stopped. You can jump over it. And now what you want to do then is jump on down. Click this lever. Then climb right on back this way. Because now the fan is on and can launch you. Boop. Ah, oh, so close. Now this one, it does move side to side. So you got to make sure it is pointed the other way. So you don't want to get on now. Now you would want to get on, land here, and then jump on down. Now this one is going to be tricky, everybody. There's a lot of things to do. So coming from here, you want to go to this lever right behind these glass windows. Click it. Which then turns on this fan right here. Jump onto this. And then jump onto this fan. Which would then send you across. Which would then that send you across. And that one sends you across to this lever. Alright, so you get onto that fan down there. To this fan. Which then will send you to that fan. Which then will send you to this fan. Which would then launch you to here. Click the lever. You're then able to jump on out easily just like that. Now go ahead and go back up 
let's see this way so let's go right here there we go and see how that fan is off that lever turn off that fan jump onto this one oh paycheck nice now once you're on this fan jump across to here and you got three levers now what you want to do is pull this lever the far left and then the far right so left and right not the middle then what you want to do jump on down go over here you're then going to see this fan is on now so you want to jump onto this fan you could do that fan and that other fan will push you across now it pushed me a little too far so here we go boom now we're where we need to be this is probably gonna be a little difficult for some but here we go make sure ah tater tots in a basket all right here we go let's try this again you want to jump with the lamp like that because it will not take you with it now all you can do then is walk into here and there is the fan click on it and now it is in your inventory now before we keep going there is another achievement that is nearby the next one is going to be called ventilated there it is and it says get sucked through the vents in Jim's warehouse in FNAF 1 so if you look down you are going to see a lever go ahead unequip the fan click the lever and then go back out the door and then jump on down and you're gonna see a vent here this vent circulates air back to the beginning of the warehouse you shouldn't climb into it but if you did you'd better make sure you've done your business here first activate it in the room above so it even tells you so this is a quick way to get back or you can just go back through it all and it's really easy you don't have to do anything else you just gotta jump around but we're gonna take the cool way and then it should just shoot you around the vent and as you're being shot around you will then get the achievement congratulations and we're now back at the beginning so go back through the door and then we're gonna go ahead and talk to Jim now we're able to uh, do another option hey potential cuz I mean hey there I've got your fan man I got it well you actually managed to find it but just giving it to me won't do no good what do you mean what you mean boy well it's not going to just shut up on its own will it I need you to destroy it for me all right <laughs> I'll destroy it any ideas there's some disassembly plant down the street from here I actually browse there to get a lot of my supply continue you might find something useful there if you have a look around they have some powerful machinery great we're using a factory to destroy a fan so what you want to do is exit the, the shop and go down the right sidewalk so you just want to go down this way and we're then going to cross the road and go to the factory which is right over there then go here and you know there's nothing complicated about this one at all all you have to do then is walk inside in here and you already go see people trying to disassemble it all you have to do is walk into that and then the fan will be destroyed and there we go not a fan is yours congratulations you guys got three of four hey Kevin don't try to escape <laughs> three of four achievements so let's go ahead and reset all right everyone the next one is going to be the very last one today all right so the next one is going to be called is called put back together this is behind a discrepant underground wall there is a shrine to one who is also broken finish the quintet to unlock a special friend mm, what could that mean so to get this one we want to do is go right over here to circus babies rentals and co FNAF 4 and the FNAF 5 location all right you don't have to be anything special I'm just gonna go ahead and be a human now I do suggest that you make sure you have 500 tokens by then by now so if you do not I suggest you play the game a little bit to get 500 tokens because you need to buy a plushie so if you go to the let's see uh there it is plushies miscellaneous you want to buy Fredbear Fredbear plushie this particular plushie has a mystical quality to it but you're not sure what it is you need this guy you want you want Fredbear plush oh 
also, if you want, you can go ahead and get your yourself a uh, night vision goggles. Now, before I almost forgot, what you want to do is click play on it so then it is in your inventory. If you do not click play, you will not have it. So here we go. We got our plushie, and I decided to get, ooh, fancy. All right, take it off. All right, here we go. Now, once you got Fredbear plush, you want to exit the building. All right, so go like that. And once you do, you're going to then go to the sewer. So you want to go onto a manhole, which is the sewer top. So right over here at the bottom of the hill, just walk on top of it, and it will teleport you to the sewer. <laughs> Something smells. Hey, if you have not got that achievement yet, then congratulations. Hey, send me back. Don't take me back to the under overworld. Now, what you want to do is turn to your left and turn to your left again, and there is going to be a hole. All you got to do is jump into it, and it will teleport you here. And all you have to do then is put the plushie on there. And just like that, put back together again is yours. And you can watch them float up. <laughs> I will put you back together. Goodbye, Fred Bear. <gasps> Goodbye. Goodbye, my friend. Oh, my gosh. I did not. Oh, there's so many of them. Please, don't hurt me. Just take me to your leader. <laughs> Hi there. You guys, uh, you're friendly, right? You're not going to. Oh. He just pulled out a Fredbear plush. That is terrifying. The Fredbear plush pulled out a Fredbear plush. Is that how you make babies? All right, so if you want to go ahead and check out the playable characters, all you got to do is then go back here, and then we're going to go ahead and check out the, uh, what is it called? Fanster the Fan. All right, so here we go. Animatronics. And he should be somewhere in here. That's Holiday's Achievement Characters. There we go. Fanster the fan play. Oh, oh, look at him. Guys, I'm a fan of his. Just like you guys are fans of mine. I get it. <laughs> anyway, so he's got some animation. Fan spin. Oh, I like how his name also is like. And fan noise and jump scare fan. Oh, it must be also a sound. This is awesome. It's so cute and adorable. I love it. Oh, my gosh. All right. Uh, no, I do not want to. I just, I want to reset. There we go. And then let's check out the other one. So it's under achievement characters. There we go. Fredbear plushies. I have to say, this one's my favorite. This is awesome. Look down. Cool perform. Oh, that's such a cute little performance. All right, sit. Oh, that's so cute. Oh, you can slide your butt while sitting. Oh, you're even more adorable. Uh, sit. oh, we already did sit. Sit, spin. Oh, a bubble head. Uh, oh, even. Cr oh, hello, little man. <laughs> uh, brothers laugh, theme song, and random teleport. Boop. Whoa. Boop. Oh, that is so cool. <laughs> Boop. Hello, what are you doing in my kitchen? Boop. Uh oh, where am I? Oh, I'm in the generator. Boop. Oh. Oh, hey, very nice. <laughs> I guess this is a good way to get stuff too. Look, <laughs> that's two of them. Yes. Boop. Oh, nothing good. Boop. Oh, dear. I just teleported into the safe room. Get me out of there. Oh, wait. No, it's Skittle juice. Ooh, delicious. And the last thing you get is an OC part. So let's go ahead and check out the propeller hat real quick. And then we'll call it a day. Oh, my gosh. I forgot I made Thanos. <laughs> propeller hat right there. Isn't that cute? Oh, that's awesome. He's going to the moon. All right, everyone. Well, that is all for today. Thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed, go ahead, leave a like, and subscribe down below, and join the Bad Hunting Squad today. I hope you guys enjoyed this, and I hope this helps you get some achievements and achieve the ultimate goal of becoming a Bad Hunter. I love you guys. Like, subscribe, join the Bad Hunting Squad. I got a Roblox group down below in the description. I got a Twitter and a Discord. I love you. And as always, stay awesome, stay cool. Good luck, bad shot, take. Bye-bye.